You really have to hand it to Jeff and Brooklyn Campbell. They are obviously astute political operatives, but tonight's guests aren't likely to be so well rehearsed. We'll ask them where the Tea Party gets its money. Did you get it? Yeah, yeah, I got it. Um, but I was noticing on the flag of the microphone, the show logo, it kind of... Look! Your function here is purely mechanical. You're the cameraman. That is all. I am front man. Let's move on. You are not the producer. We don't have a producer on this thing. You know the whole spare crews memo we got from the foundation? Stop it! What's in it for me? Well, sometimes... Forgive me. Housewives have a tendency, especially out here in the country, to follow the lead of their husbands. Well, I'm not married. Oh, I, I didn't mean... Not, not that I have anything against housewives, you know? The right man came along and everything. I am a good gardener. I wouldn't mind taking care of a house. What do you do? I teach comp lit at Binghamton. You're... Technically, I chair the department, but I'm on sabbatical this year. But who's keeping track, right? I'm just saying, I wouldn't know. Well, think about it. Churches are tax write-offs. You want to keep that write-off, you stay in the church. These pastors and their big mega churches? Right. They must be sending out their flocks. Here's how I see it, Chase. There's got to be a mama and a papa. Someone's got to be the adult. And I am starting to smell a little Huey Long in the air. We're not just putting chicken in a pot anymore. We are shoving home loans in the pot. Chase, we're going to go broke. Huey Long? Do a wiki on him, okay? You've never been pressured by your pastor to attend a tea party rally? I don't see that happening. Why is that? I'm Jewish. Is this your first tea party event? No, it isn't. Is this your first tea party event? No. Is this your first tea party event? No. Probably my third or fourth. So this is not your first tea party event? Oh, definitely not. We've been partying since uh, April 15th anyways. Have you attended a tea party event before this? Yes, absolutely. And if I may ask you, how much are you being paid to attend this event? Oh, not paid anything. Not paid anything. So the only thing you will receive is a paid day from your employer? Uh, no. And are you on a payroll for all of them, or are you booked for one at a time? I volunteer my time one at a time. This means that you are not paid anything except for what your employer allows you to take off to come to these events? I'm not employed. Not employed. I'm a stay-at-home mom. A stay-at-home mom. And how much are you being paid to attend this event? Uh, well, let's see. I should probably deduct about 40 or 50 bucks for this event. <laughs> so, in other words, I'm not being paid anything. It's out of my own pocket. Well, there you have it. You've just witnessed a cover-up of the big corporate dollars that bankroll events of this sort. One walks away with the sense that these people are deeply threatened by a youthful president who represents a dramatic break with the past. Next time on Front Man, we'll be asking this question. Are balanced budgets racist? I'm Chase Peterson, and this is Front Man. Why do you keep staring at my flag pin? There's nothing funny about it. 
This pin was given to me by President Obama. Well, look, we were snookered. You were. We were. Do you remember on the campaign trail when Barack Obama got such heat for not wearing a flag pin? It was all over Fox News. It was all over talk radio. They wouldn't leave him alone over it. And then, when he announced on the campaign trail that he had campaigned in 57 states, everybody realized why he wouldn't wear a flag pin. They only had 50 stars on them. A Jew at a tea party round. Cut the tape. What? I think it's I think it's point man. Don't think. It's not your job. Just do your job. And don't think. And you'll have a long, good career ahead of you. Do you know there was not one single take? Not one single take where the kid didn't have an opinion? Got so I couldn't even pause for fear the cameraman would start asking the questions. And it was at that time, at that very point, that the Obama campaign had new flags made with 60 stars representing all 60 states. I'm the only one in the media now who has this pin. Pretty soon all the news anchors will be wearing them. So, I say we just cut our losses, spike it. We look like idiots. Well, we can't, um, uh, technically, uh, I mean, uh, illegally, they can cut it any way they want. We agree to that? As a condition of going to the party. Am I to understand that they have all the footage? Right. Including this? Oh, no, no, he's internal. I actually, um... <laughs>